So uh, here, let's just imagine you want to offset some keyframes um, like you would in Maya or Blender, uh, but you need it to. Uh, let's say you want to do this for my uh, left arm. So right click on it, so sometimes it can, it can reach the eye case of the hair strands. So don't worry, just turn the view or try clicking somewhere else. Um, once you've selected this, be sure to have a loop key on your all layers. So I'm making this uh, on Elise, but you can do this on your animation as well. The loop key simply instantiate the first key, so it's it's the same key. So when I will edit uh, that key like this, the loop key will do the same. Okay. So once we've done this, we can extract your layer. So it will simply create the same layer, but without any other joints. Then you will offset your animation like this, for example. If you make a play range, you will see that your animation still loops. It's just because I have the loop key, which repeats also the animation before my first frame and after, of course. But if I want to, um, let's say, uh, freeze it and export it as is in a Unity or Unreal or Marmoset or whatever else you want, I will need to get rid of the extra keyframes. If I don't do that, the animation will correspond to this. Okay, and you don't want that. So I've just clicked on this uh, magnifier. So this one will frame the whole uh, animated range. So then what I will need to do is clump my animation to this, from, from this to this, okay? So we need to just create one keyframe here, go here and go a second keyframe, and then select these keys, delete them, and remove the loop, okay? And once you've done that, you can right click on the magnifier here, it will reframe the animation, and here you have your loop.